Hey fellow gamers, it's Cozy Mel and I'm coming at you with another Paleo video. We are here in front of some of the new furniture that we have been able to get from the Flotsam collection, but we're here to talk about new furniture you haven't seen yet. That's right, the Dubs have sprung into action with a new set of spring fever decor that is going to be coming out with the update. And the update is scheduled for March 25th to coincide with the Steam release of Paleo. So according to the news that the devs released today, a spring fever decor set will be coming. This set is going to be featuring quite a few things that you're going to want to add to your collection. There's going to be, it's like a fire pit, but it's almost like a double fire pit. I've never seen anything quite like it. It looks like two cauldron pots stacked on top of each other. So I'm already thinking that instead of using it just as a fire pit, some of you are going to be all about this in your witchy themed furniture decor. There's also going to be a, um, archway. It's a wooden archway that looks like it's made from teak or cherry, um, and it has a crisscross design on the sides of it. And there are also a couple of ground light sources, and these look like they would be on sticks that you would shove into the ground, so you could perhaps control the height of them. There's also going to be a nice pergola, and the pergola has four legs, and then it's got cross pieces on the top, and hanging down is wisteria, purple wisteria, and then there's like the long purple draped wisteria hanging down, and it is beautiful. I, I, I It's going to appear in everybody's garden. It will be in every garden. I, I predict that for sure. There's also going to be some lighting. You guys have wanted it for a long time, the twinkle type lighting. So each section of lighting is two posts, and then it has the twinkle lights that hang between the two posts. And there are three lights hanging from the strand that connects the two posts together. So you would make them one set at a time and then put them next to each other if you wanted to string them all across your yard or the front of your house or whatever. Yeah. Um, we had kind of a brief look at those not that long ago um, by accident, and then they were taken away the next day. <laughs> but we had sort of an idea that they might be coming at some point because of that, and now we are getting them. Very excited about that. There's a wheelbarrow, which is really interesting. That's going to look great by the garden. Can you imagine? I mean, it just looks fantastic. It's got a lot of metal wrapped on it, and it's made out of a real heavy wood. You'll see it in the picture, but that will be nice. There's also a more standard fire pit that does not look like a cauldron. So <laughs> make of that what you will. I don't know if we'll be able to cook on it or if it is actually just for feet and hand warming like a traditional rock fire pit would be. Then there is also what I would call a trellis, and the trellis is white, and it does have the trellis work on the sides like you would see climbing roses climbing up or something um, in Grandma's garden. Um, in English gardens, it's just a, a very traditional white trellis, beautiful. I think that's going to show up in a lot of backyards. Then there is also something that um, we would call a patio swing. And this patio swing has a roof covering it, uh, but I believe it's an open lattice roof. And again, it has the ferns um, that are very light and airy and spring-like ferns uh, going across the tops of it. And then little white flowers and ferns going down each side. And so um, if you've always wanted a porch swing, patio swing, or outdoor swing, it's uh, just gorgeous. Looks really nice. 
There is also uh, going to be the edging for paths that um, our garden edging that you guys have all been asking for. That also was sort of a uh, surprise tease uh, in December when we were getting our Christmas stuff. That and the little twinkle lights both uh, showed up at some people's plots, but not every plot. But I think we've all seen them in people's pictures by now. And everybody has said, we want those, we want those. So, of course, it will be great now um, for everybody to finally be able to get them. So, um, and there's also, you can not really see it very well in the picture, but also in one of the pictures, there's a little rock statue. It looks kind of like the ones that um, have rocks stacked on top of each other with maybe a little bit of a form at the very top. So it's a little bit difficult to see, but there is a really cute little um, rock statue. And I think that'll be just beautiful in our gardens and our backyards and front porches and all those things too. So all together, it looks like, uh, well, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, about, uh, maybe 12 pieces, but don't hold me to it. I'm just guessing. But uh, there's quite a few pieces in the collection, and I think you guys are going to absolutely love it. So there you go with another little bit of Deb update number six, Spring Fever Decor Set. So please see my other videos because there is wedding clothing coming next week, and that is in another video. There are also some other things upcoming that I have placed in another video. So I'm trying to give you little short bites instead of a big hour long thing this time. So maybe you can uh, get through them all. So please like and subscribe and ring that bell. And then you'll get notified as each one of these little bite videos hits the market and you can watch it. Okay, that'd be great. Like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.